Let's set up Safari to work with Selenium WebDriver. Before continuing, make sure you have the Safari browser installed. So in order to use Safari Driver for Selenium 2.45 and up, you'll also need the Selenium browser extension installed. You can find the download link by going to the Selenium repository, opening the wiki for the Safari Driver page, and then clicking the link to the downloads page. Here you want to go inside the folder with the latest pre-built extension. Click the link to download, or if you want to be fancy, you can use curl instead. Once it has downloaded, open the target folder. Double click the extension and then click trust to install it. Also, make sure that enable WebDriver is checked. Now, I'm going to run a quick test to confirm that Safari Driver works. I'll be using the JavaScript bindings for WebDriver. In my test directory, I already have the node module Selenium WebDriver installed. I also have a pre-written script that launches a Selenium instance, sleeps for 3 seconds, and then quits the instance. Now I'm going to run my script with Safari as my browser. You can see that it works like a charm. And that's all it takes to get started with Safari Driver.